Hey, this is a quick trick. You may be um, familiar with the problem. You listen to your um, sounds in the browser. For example, drum sounds like those over here. And they sound really powerful and snappy and everything. Um, also maybe hi-hats or claps or something. And then later you drag them into uh, your project. Um, and somehow they don't sound that snappy and powerful anymore. For example, kicks, like a kick sounds like this. But then, and it seems to lack a little bit of the snappiness. Something seems to be missing. Ableton sometimes has a default option that enables fades automatically on short samples. Now see what's happening here. This is the default um, setting from Ableton. It fades in the beginning of your kick and it does that automatically on your um, samples that you're loading in. It won't do that if you play them over here, but it does it in the arrangement later. So um, let's see without it. See, there's the attack. It's actually just cutting out the attack of this kick. And we certainly don't want that. Maybe we want this fade over here. Maybe this is sometimes useful, but we certainly don't want this fade over here. So um, what we have to do, we have to go to the settings and um, uh, make sure to turn these options off. So we find we go to uh, the preferences and we go down to record warp lounge. Default warp mode is beats. Okay, create fades on clip edges. On. You might want to turn this off over here. Close your preferences and um, go back, pre listen. Your kicks and then drag them in here, let them see the fades and you see no fades applied on the edges. So that's, um, that's basically what you want to have to do with your um, samples and with your preferences in Ableton. Um, I, over here I used some uh, uh, drum samples out of our D Premium sample pack. We are offering this on our website, so check the description if you're interested in organic um, deep house and you know, like deep, uh, like more natural sounding drum sounds, and you will find something. So I hope you uh, enjoyed this tutorial um, and this short trick. Make sure to uh, subscribe to our channel and follow our activities on Facebook. And see you next time.